and please this is a no joke a serious prayer if you want to really receive uh, healing breakthroughs when we are praying this prayer pray it with everything in you now listen to this the Bible says in Psalm 97 verse 3 to 5 fire goes before God fire goes before God and burns up his enemies run about I told you God is a consuming fire and the Bible says that fire goes ahead of him to consume his enemies run about before Jesus Christ came um, John the Baptist went ahead of him to make the crooked path straight the fire of God going ahead of you also to make every crooked path straight the Bible says that when God is coming fire always go ahead of him to burn up to burn up his enemies run about that's what the Bible says that every time that the Israelites when they were leaving Egypt to Canaan every time they were about to move from one place to another they would blow the trumpet and shout oh God arise and let our enemies be scattered oh god arise and let our enemies be scattered and the bible says that god was a pillar of fire in the night to them and a pillar of clouds by day unto them and whenever they were coming they were their enemies were panic panicking afraid terrified and they were running away from them because fire goes ahead of god to consume his enemies run about the Lord God that we are serving is a consuming fire. Tonight, the fire of God will go ahead of you and consume your enemies run about. In this month, any enemy of your progress, every enemy of your healing, every enemy of your deliverance, any enemy of your finances, any enemy of your marriage, every enemy of your children, may the fire of God go ahead of you and burn up your enemies run about. As you start Monday, fire of God going ahead of you to burn up all your enemies in your workplace. Those who are planning to get you fired, laid off. Those who are planning evil against your marriage, planning evil against your children to get them to be vagabonds and good for nothing and nothing for good and destroy their destiny. Witchcraft, demonic plans of the enemy are concerning your life. May fire go ahead of you and burn up your enemies run about. Fire goes ahead of God. The Bible says in Revelation chapter 11 verse 5 that there were two witnesses during the time of great tribulation when the Antichrist came. These two witnesses were from God and he brought them on earth. And the Bible says that and if anyone wants to harm them, fire proceed out of their mouth to devour their enemies. God gave them fire in their mouth. Now when anybody wanted to trouble these prophets that God brought in those days, which is yet to come the fire will go ahead of them their mouth and consume today your mouth has been touched by the coals of fire as you open your mouth right now to pray fire will go ahead of you out of your mouth and begin to burn up every enemies of your soul your life your destiny run about in the name of jesus christ it is an unquenchable fire it is the judgment fire it is the destructive fire of god it is the consuming fire. It suffocates your enemies. It, it is a real hot charcoal of fire. It is the raging fire. It is hills of fire. Witches cannot stand it. Demons cannot stand it. Satan himself cannot stand it. It is the unquenchable fire. And this is what you are about to use against your enemies tonight. So any you are going to pray. You are going to pray this first prayer. And this prayer is concerning limitations, any invisible chains, any invisible chains that is holding you bound, that is blocking you from making advancement in any area of your life, preventing you from enjoying your marital home, preventing you from receiving healing in your body, pre preventing you from getting deliverance from the powers of darkness, holding you bound, postponing your breakthroughs postponing and delaying your victories, your dreams and visions, your pregnancy, your job, your education, your promotion, your race. Wicked spirits that are holding you bound, placing limitation, 
roadblocks, blocks, curses, demonic yokes, burdens, retrogression upon you. Tonight, when you pray this prayer, the fire of God will go ahead of you and burn up, burn up your enemies run about. Let me tell you a story tonight and then you understand this prayer, then you pray it. Tonight, to today, a friend of mine came in, uh, my mom's friend came with her daughter. She has been looking for, uh, going to the uh, MVA to look for this driving license for almost five times. Every time she goes, she fails every time for five times and today the parents were trying to get her back and they were already giving her problems because she wasn't getting it so when i came in i saw that they were going through so much with her and so i offered to go to uh, to the driving place to help her get the driving license and i knew that it was a limitation in her life she wasn't breaking through so when i went i told the lord lord please show her your favor and when she went she went on to do the test this time around she passed even though she made a minor mistake that, that could have disqualified her but because of the favor of the lord there was a breakthrough and the spirit of the lord came to me and said son this is how many of my children they are experiencing limitations invisible chains in their lives blocking them from accessing some breakthroughs in their lives you have tried over and over again and you have never been able to cross over to possess your possession because the devil has placed limitation for the girl it was a, an ordinary driving license which she was failing she has failed five times she was going the, the, sec, the, the sixth time some of us we have failed exams over and over some of us we have failed one marriage after the other some of us we are failing immigration now you go for immigration for your green card and they turn you back you have been looking for a job over and over again and every, every time you apply there's limitation they never call you they never give you the application uh, the job some of you it is pregnancy anytime you become pregnant you lose with true miscarriage there is a limitation today god says that as we invoke this fire any limitation that is blocking your destiny blocking your life blocking your breakthrough blocking your marriage blocking your promotion blocking and delaying your dreams and vi vision Whatever limitation, all of us, we know our limitations. Everybody's limitation is different. This girl, she was in college. Her limitation was not being able to get her driver's license. And so she was stranded every day. She was dependent on her parents and she couldn't move forward. Some of you, it is your education. Some of you, you can't get a job. Some of you, it is, mar it is marriage. You have done everything to settle to get married. But something seems to be blocking you. Today, you are going to pray that the consuming fire of God the blazing fire of God the fire of God will burn every yoke every chain of limitation over your life in the name of Jesus Christ and as you pray this prayer God is going to bring deliverance to you because today because I went to this girl I told God Lord I am with her today no more failing no more being defeated no more the cycle of failing she has failed for five, five times today i've offered to be with her may you show up your glory and the lord answered our prayers she went even though she was almost about to fail i said lord as she enters into the car to go and do the test may goodness and mercy be with her may your angels be with her and take over and everything went on smoothly she came out with her license tonight somebody is going to get your breakthrough today the chain the invisible chain the invisible joke the invisible curse that has been placed upon your life by witchcraft that has been placed upon your life by generational covenant ancestral spirit principalities and powers demons and dominions generational curses witchcraft familiar spirit strong man divination and spells enchantment and sorcery evil pronouncement against your life to block you as you pray this prayer i tell you the truth god says that tonight as i lead prayers I should lead my people in breaking them loose from every invisible chains, every invisible prison that they are in. And the Lord is going to cause you to come out. The Lord is going to break you out loose from the chains of limitation, the chains of stagnation, the chains, the chain that is holding you bound and keeping you not moving forward in the name of Jesus Christ. So you are going to pray. 
the father let your fire let your fire break every invisible chains of limitation over my life let it break over my life in jesus name and as you pray this prayer the holy spirit the father of god will touch you and loose you and break you loose and you will begin to move forward with your life whatever area you need god's intervention the lord will give you divine intervention in the name of our lord jesus christ let's pray right My heart is over with.